Hello, my name is Dan Strudelmeyer. I'm a senior engineer with the City of Westminster. I've worked with the city for over 35 years and managed lots of uh, capital improvement projects for the city. So Westminster's water storage tanks are used to store water for emergency storage, which is actually most of the water in the tanks, and for operational storage, that's for daily use, and also storage for firefighting. Over the past five years, the city has replaced and demolished several water storage tanks, including the old Sunset Ridge elevated tank. And that tank was replaced with a new Sunset Ridge elevated tank, which we're standing by now. Uh, this new three million gallon storage tank has a concrete shaft or concrete base, and then a steel bowl or steel cone on top of the tank to hold three million gallons of water. A couple of components of this tank are the, uh, the pipe that allows water to enter the tank and also to be released from the tank. So the inflow outflow line, this pipe, uh, we get pressure readings from, this tells us how much water is in the tank, liquid we can monitor remotely. Um, on this side, have another pipe that, that extends up into the uh, into the tank and that's actually the overflow pipe in case the tank is too full, too full water will overflow to this pipe and into the uh, storm water system. And this unit on the wall is, uh, provides our cathodic protection for the steel. It, uh, it prevents the steel from corroding by sending uh, electric pulse that enters the water and it keeps corrosion from building up on the steel. It helps extend the useful life of the tank. So stairs are used to access the bottom of the dry riser pipe, which I'm standing in right now, and then a catwalk comes across from the stairs. And the dry riser pipe gives us access to the roof of the tank. So right now we're standing in three million gallons of water. So the initial phase of the construction included construction of the concrete shaft, which was a cast in place concrete, and also included a cast in place concrete roof that the steel bowl actually sits on and is supported by the concrete. So once the concrete shaft was completed, then the steel plates from the bowl were welded together actually on the ground, and then the, the entire steel bowl was hoisted uh, with jacking to the top of the concrete shaft. Our operators at our water plant watch the water level in the, in the tank and it's actually fed from other pump stations around the city that maintain the water level in the tank. And then during high demand periods during the day, water, the water level in these elevated tanks is lowered and monitored constantly by our, our staff at our water plants. The Sunset Ridge Elevated Water Storage Tank Project was an $8 million two-year project that included site improvements such as landscaping, where we seeded with dry land grass, planted some new trees, and also provided new security fencing and stormwater detention. The landscaping, although it doesn't look great now, it'll take a, a year or two to get established and then it'll look nice with native grasses growing on site. So with the completion of the Sunset Ridge Elevated Water Storage Tank, we now have enough water in storage to meet our water demands through the build-out of the city of Westminster.